this is a quick refresher on what I have as my um, <clears throat> irrigation system in my house. I have two different kind of irrigation. I have the ratio and I have an orbit. The orbit actually controls the hose timers and the ratio controls the other uh, in-ground timers. Um, I'll quickly just, uh, you know, as, as you can see, this is what I have here. And it runs all across my house in the garage all the way to the backyard for one. And the other one goes through the, here to the other side to right here for my in-ground sprinklers in my front of my yard. Um, I don't think I'll go through the whole process of turning them on, but pretty much that's what waters my whole front yard. And going over to the other side of my house here in the front. And I'll fast forward and jump to the backyard. So this is the backyard. I just did a, a recent cut a while ago. So as you can see, that is one of the um, sprinklers that's con uh, connected to the orbit. And I can tell you right now, this right now, this sprinkler is actually one of the best I've actually used in terms of uh, uh, oscillating sprinklers that's connected to a hose. I've had several and that brand is actually the best. I'm going through. This is my backyard. I have in-ground sprinklers right here. But I don't have any over there. So that controls that side. And I think there's a bunch of sprinklers right here. They spread out. I didn't put those in. I just actually just changed a few things. There goes a bird. And one of my wonderful solar powered cameras. There's another sprinkler here. Here here and that's a Titan one sequence there's another one here and another one should be down here there was one over there but I accidentally broke it but I didn't decide to replace it and that's fine and then we have one here so this right now is the wonderful orbits that's controlled by my phone um, as I said on a previous video you could not pair it with the Android, you had to do it with an iPhone, um, which you know, um, which is strange that they never told you about. That's my controller for my other sprinklers over there. Um, so as you can see, there are four lines connected. These two are just for my regular hose, and these are this is going to be this is my right side sprinkler and this is my left side sprinkler. And I'll turn them on so you can see. So these are what I used to have before. I disconnected them for the oscillator because that's actually there's a wider spread. I'm actually going to turn it on right now so you can see how it works. Um, this is the Beehive app, app. And I'm going to take a step back <laughs> because I don't want to get sprinkled. Go to my zones. I didn't put any pictures yet. I did it before when I first set it up. So it's at street side. Turn it on. And I'm going to test it right now. check and here we go and that pretty much controls the side of my house which is a good spread you know and it's you know time sequence and everything so it actually came on this morning I didn't even realize that I had set it because basically I had set it up last night, but I didn't realize I had set it to come on uh, today. I just had this program. So I am going to stop it. Right here. Stop. Alright, there we go. So that's from one side. I'm going to go do the other side right now. Yeah, my son takes up, these are pretty much took over the whole backyard. Uh, this is where he runs his little car and everything. So, that's the hose coming through. Boom, 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 boom. I want to get too close to that one. Okay, I'm going to turn it on again. Once you set it up on the Android, I mean, so on the iPhone, you can configure it from the Android. Uh, I mean, you can control it from the Android, but you cannot configure it from the Android. It has to be configured in terms of the blue, um, the Wi-Fi. Bluetooth you can set up, but who cares about the Bluetooth when you want to be across the country?
controlling your device. Yeah, Bluetooth is only for if you're close by, so I just turned it on. Here goes a bird, he's gonna be surprised. There we go. And again, a good spread. As I said, that's one of the better ones in terms of um, hose sprinklers. Uh, I think the brand is Molnor, I think. When I get closer to it, I'll see the name. That brand also has a timer sprinkler, but their thing is two hundred dollars. The um, the orbit is I think it's eighty or seventy bucks for the four four zone, and then I think another twenty or thirty bucks for the Wi-Fi hub. But uh, once you have it set up via an, an iPhone, <laughs> it runs perfectly well, and I can now turn it off. And just so you know, again, this is my iPhone, you can see. I'm going to switch to my Android, which uh, is in my other pocket. Actually, it's the phone that I'm on, <laughs> so I can't use that one. Um, but pretty much, you can actually configure it, or I mean, uh, you can actually test it with that other phone. But I um, can't do it right now, because I'm actually recording from that phone, sadly. Um, but this brand, as I was mentioning, is a... Melnor brand and it's pretty cool you know it's how you can uh, set it up and, co and configure it um, I just cut my grass so that's why it looks a little yucky but um, yeah this is to conclude on that whole setup um, you know because I have everything set up actually I want to turn on my backyard sprinklers so you can see how those work too um, I think I can do it from my it's on the same floor that I'm on again but I'm just going to do a manual turn on. And then actually I'm going to test the other side too. Just to make sure. That's not a thing. I think I'm going to change that right here. But these are all those other sprinklers. Hmm, we have a damaged one right over there. I gotta go check that to, uh, to make sure because I don't wanna waste water, so to speak. Okay, and that concludes everything right now. Pieces. This is just an, a patch up video so I can actually show you the app on um, Ferraccio. Had to switch phones. Um, so, pretty much, this is the Ratio app. And if I want to actually turn on these sprinklers right here, I step back so I don't get soaked. I'm turn that on. I'm going to do a quick run. And three minutes should be good. Stop that for a second. I'm going to go to the beehive. Give me a second to find the beehive, wherever the heck it is. Here it is. Wait for it to load. Bingo. So this is the beehive on the Android. See? Android phone. And actually, let me just come show you both of them together. The iPhone variant. Where am I on the home? Pretty much iPhone Android. So right now I'm going to use the Android to turn on the sprinkle over here. Let's go to zones and find house side test. A little bit different. Press the play because on the iPhone it has a check mark, on the Android it has a play button. And there we go. And I'm going to stop it. Go. It should stop anytime now. On the iPhone, it has on the test it has a 
has a check mark versus on this one has a play. So let me do a check again. Okay, hold on, let me go back in there. Test, check. But in uh, messing up by jumping back and forth between the two units. Because, you know, sometimes that stuff can't... Oh, it actually is working. I didn't even realize. Stop it. Give me a second. I'm trying to stop it right now. And there it goes. All right. That wraps that up, and I am done. Pieces.